Hello guys, welcome back to another X Defiant video. So there's going to be some changes coming soon to the game. And hopefully in this video, I can address some concerns you guys may have because a lot of the problems you may be experiencing with this game, the devs have responded and they said what they're looking into and what they're going to be working on. So we're going to go over it in this video. If you guys don't know, X Defiant is a first person shooter game. It is free to play on all platforms. It is cross play. It's made by Ubisoft and it's actually a really good game, but there is some problems to it, but I feel like if they tweak those problems this game can really achieve something so we're going to go over the list so the main problem right now for me especially is the hitbox registration have you ever been shooting an enemy and then you run around the corner and he still ends up killing you even though you were way past that corner that has something to do with the net code and the hitboxes are just horrible right now so they did say that they are listening and they're working on improvements he said there are a thousand things that can affect the net code and we need to investigate and fix each and every one so it will take time before they can make improvements but do know that developers know that there's a hitbox issue in this game and they're working very hard to fix it now the next issue being addressed which I'm sure a lot of you guys have problems with is the jump spamming in this game. I never seen people jump so much in a shooter game until this game came out. I thought Call of Duty was bad, but this game, the jumping blows it out of the water. It's too, it's crazy. So they said when it comes to jump shotting, especially, they do intend to penalize players for too many repeated jumps and crouches by adding aim sway. Now, this was disabled after their test while they made needed improvements, and unfortunately, they did not add it back into the game at launch. So it was in the beta, but it was not in the actual game to where if you were to jump, then your gun would sway and you won't have that good of an accuracy. But they did say rest assured that they will get this in as soon as possible. They want players to enjoy all the mechanics of the game, but they don't want people to actually abuse the mechanics. And from what I'm seeing, people really abuse the jumping in this game and it's kind of really annoying. A next thing that's being addressed is the snipers. Apparently people are complaining about the snipers either being too quick or too strong. I don't know. I personally don't have a problem with the snipers, but some people do. So they just said they're looking into it and they're gonna see uh, what they can do about that. Also, cheaters. Now, I haven't run into any cheaters in this game. I do play on PC, but no cheaters in my lobbies as I know of. Um, but they did say cheaters are being banned and investigated and it will not be tolerated. But as they said many times, it's a constant battle. And as we know from other games like Call of Duty, for example, even they have a hard time stopping hackers. So that's a thing that's gonna be in every single game, whether it's console or PC, there's gonna be hackers everywhere, the people that just try to ruin the fun, but just know they're gonna start cracking down on the hackers. Another thing is kill cams. A lot of people were questioning why they were in kill cams in this game. This will be a perfect game for kill cams and they did say that they're working on it. There will be kill cams in this game eventually, but at a later date. They will add custom button mapping as well. They will also add keyboard and mouse support for consoles. They will add a pinging system where you guys, I guess you can ping enemies, which I feel like you don't really need it in this type of game with it being so fast paced. You don't really need pinging because by the time you ping them, they're already dead by another teammate. But I guess that can be good in certain situations, especially because there is a search and destroy game mode that will be coming to the game soon. So pinging can be very helpful in that game because it'll probably be more a little bit more slow pace. Um, the dead sex spider bot ability has a visual bug, which they are working on. And they said they want this game to be around for many years. It's not gonna be like Call of Duty where every year a new X Defiant 2, X Defiant 3 will come out. They're pretty much going to support this same game for years to come, adding new content similar to like Rainbow Six, how they're still adding content to this day, even though the game been out for like 10 plus years. I don't even know at this point, which is one thing I love about Ubisoft is they will continue to pump content into one game as long as people are playing it and there's a demand for it. So the fact that they made the game free to play was actually very smart. And that's really it for right now. And honestly, those cover all the issues I had with the game which was mainly the hitboxes and the spam jumping. Besides that, I'm loving this game. Once they fix that, this game honestly will be perfect for me. If you guys have any input of your own of stuff you would love to see changed or any of critiques or criticism or feedback of the game, drop them in the comments down below. Hit that thumbs up if you guys are excited for the changes to come and subscribe if you wanna see more X Defined gameplay.